Okay, I want to emphasize with syllabication, these are strategies to uh, break down a multi-syllable words into syllables or decodable parts, okay? And it's always going to be, we use this for, for two-syllable, three-syllable words, four-syllable words, and th there's a couple of rules that, that everyone should know, and I'm just going to highlight a few of them. I'm not going to do all of them, but just a few of them, the ones that I think are going to be most important. Now, this is... Uh, this is a great picture. It's actually got a ton of information. When we do this uh, one in the class and I show this picture, I mean, teachers see this picture and they don't realize all the things that are going on here. I mean, this picture literally has all the rules. It, it has all the syllable division rules. It has all the syllable types that we just mentioned, right? Closed syllable, open syllable, R control, vowel teams, right? Uh, but it has a lot of them, the big ones. And then it has the some of the syllabication rules that we're going to do. It actually has the definitions of them here. And what we're going to do is uh, we're just going to, I'm just going to pick a few of these to do. Um, I'm going to do, I'm going to do a vowel, consonant, consonant, vowel, where there's a division between the two consonants. And we can see that in a couple of different places. Uh, let's see. Uh, we could see that. Uh, well, I guess it's uh, it's going on here. Divide between the double consonants. That's one place in which it's happening. It's also happening in some other places here. That's one of the big ones that we'll do. Vowel, constant, constant, vowel, and dividing the syllables there. Uh, I think we'll also do this one right here, wherever we have a vowel, consonant, vowel, and there's a division there, creating an open syllable. Uh, we'll look at this one here as well, where we have a, 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 um, an open syllable forming in the syllabication or the division of the syllables. So, so let's just, uh, let's see if we can get these two rules down. So the first one is called uh, the CCV. This is when we have a, let's say a two syllable word. And we notice in this two syllable word, we notice this pattern, vowel, constant, constant, vowel. And we can take that word and we can divide the syllable in between the two constants. So for example, in the word sister, we have vowel, constant, constant, vowel. We can divide the, it up there. And so we have sis, ter. Notice that um, this is gonna be short right? So it's sis. This is always going to be a short first syllable. Sister. Or how about this one right here? Uh, this is a vowel, consonant, consonant, vowel. So we cut it here. The vowel is short. After. Okay. So the first one is always going to be short. All right. Give me a thumbs up. You seeing this? Okay. Very important. So, so this the, the CCV words make up a lot of everyday words, or even um, VC, uh, VC, they could be like words like napkin. Like, here is something where we have vowel, constant, constant, vowel. It's a two syllable word. We teach the student how to divide the syllables in between the two consonants, and we teach them that the, the first consonant is always short, and the second, the second, uh, sorry, the first syllable is always short. The second syllable in napkin is CVC. So that's also going to be short too. So we have a closed syllable in the beginning and a closed syllable at the end, making this uh, um, two C CVC words. All right, team, take a moment now and read this definition on CVC. It's a really common one. And what it, in words like napkin, this would be like, like some of the most basic syllabication that you do with a student. Essentially, what you're teaching them is to segment the word into two syllables, two CVC words, or two very basic words, okay? So uh, we see that in, uh, in all these words right here. You can use that rule. Under, hot dog, sunset, cactus, sister, falcon, okay? The first uh, syllable is always short. And if the next syllable is CVC, that vowel is always going to be short as well. So these are closed syllable words. Okay. Now, this is the first one. 
Very important. 